So this store is unique, Culture King. Sell all sneakers except for Jordans and Nike. It's definitely unique, the vibe is crazy. Fly DJ, it's huge up here too. And because they can't sell Nike or Jordans, they make it up by selling new balances. And they got all kinds of flavor, including these 96s, which we've seen everywhere. They also got you with the Aces as well, the gel light threes, different, different suede. Quality is there, Nike. Oh, I like those blue ones. These joints are hitting for 110. I like that one too as well, yo. Damn, this is 120 for these joints. I wonder if they're comfy. Oh, we're not done. Oh, we're not done. They got the AIs in the building, the answers. Fours, I believe, yup, 160. They got the Sockanese. Wow, like this, 150 is the price. Looks comfy. I remember seeing these in Marshalls, but I didn't pull the trigger on them. They're going for 130. Now nah, they do sell a lot of apparel, a lot. And also a lot of hats. This hat's reaching all the way to the ceiling. And this store is huge. This store do get licensed brands like Michelin and F, New Era, ASIC, New Balance, Puma, you name it. Everything with exception, Jordan and Nike but they do something special for you. So apparently this is the vault. This is where they have the exclusive stuff. Obviously you can tell they got a whole bunch of jewelry in here. I don't even know if I'm supposed to be back here. But dude, they got watches. Is that Roly? I have no idea. Yeah, but it's different back here. This store is like one of a kind. I haven't seen much stores that look like this, but they sell multiple different brands. They sell their own brand and they have different varieties of things. The store is literally plastered with hats from top to bottom. That's crazy. So the one thing they do here is if your purchase is over $250, they allow you to shoot free throws. So if you hit five, you get a backpack for free. If you hit 10, you get some J's. But you got 10 shots to hit 10 free throws. That ain't gonna be easy. And back here, something different too. Last chance, hat wear 20% off. I'm not sure if they do custom joints back here, but new era fitted. Look how they do custom embroidery. I haven't seen a store like this ever. Stuff is so hard to reach, they got a picker in here. You drive around picking clothes and hats and look at the hat wall, y'all. That's a hat wall. Jordan 45 jersey, authentic Michelin S, 300 beans. Or you can get the all black 23, fire. Or the red joint, no, it's Rodman. <laughs> but it's in for the same price though. One thing about this store, it also has some shoes that I have never seen before. For example, I have seen, not those, these. I have seen these before, but in different colors. This is the first time I've seen this colorway. Mommy of the 76 here, colorway, instant font fairy, maybe, but they're going for a buck 60. So this guy tried his best, and at best, he hit like two out of five. Remember, you gotta hit five in a row. Right, so sir. it was my time. Yeah, yeah, time for me to shine. Uh, I'm gonna see what my warm up shots look like. All right, one more. So the ball was in my hand. And I ain't gonna lie, I missed my first warm up shot. I thought I shot an air ball, but I didn't. But then I started to cook one after another. See, I missed. Different angles show different story. That's me doing a walk away free throw. That's when I hit all five in a row. Then they asked, would well, you like to go for a 10? I said I would, but then they told me the prize, which is the Jordans, they don't have it in my size. So I said, let's do it for fun. And I wasn't missing. At all. Back to back. To back. But I try to be cute. I took my last shot and I did like a look away. And ironically, even though I missed the last shot because there was no prize for me at the end, I knew I could have hit all 10. And mind you, this is a guy who haven't played ball in a right year here. and a half. Okay, cool. I'll take a look at this. Yeah, what do I get? A bag or a hat? Uh, a bag, it's either a duffel bag, hat, or a side bag. Oh, uh, what's, the, what's the hat look like? The Culture King's hat. So I came through and I shot my hoop. I made five in a row and then I went for the 10. I missed the last shot. I don't know if sure it was on camera. Some editor told me I could keep going. I wasn't going to claim the 10 if I make the 10. I was just trying to see how much I could hit. And I hit damn near nine in a row. But I missed the 10th, which also was in on camera. Pack on my back, hat backwards. Hit the three, none but net. That was on camera though. I need to get back on the court. You know how people say they take from the casino? I'm already up in Vegas, y'all. I did it so y'all don't have to. First store, I was able to capitalize, got me a free bag. You supposed to cash out around $250, then you get the play. But they give me like five coins for free, and I went and took advantage of that. So next up, we about to go to Urban Necessities. I've never been here, ever. It's also huge, bro. Damn.
Uh, this is the dunk wall. Nothing but dunk. I think it's about 12 feet, 13 feet high. They got all kinds of flavors. Let's see if there's any Air Jordan 1 aficionados watching this. Y'all know what these are called? Y'all remember these? What about those? Ah, yes, nine and a half. Price is not on there. What about these? Y'all remember these? They're all denim joints. I'm showing you stuff before 2020. A lot of y'all don't remember Jays before then. The 2020 was all the hype of the Air Jordan 1. So y'all never seen stuff like these. The white cement. Ah, this one with the jump man on the back. So it's even older. What about the Chagar set? Y'all remember those? I remember I called that outlet and I was able to cop not this colorway, the champagne version. Some of you guys remember this. My soul separated on my bed. I get that taken care of. Point cord, playoff, Ferrari 14. Supposed to be a darker belt. It looks faded. Piece of Ferrari 14. This wall brings back memories. What about these tins? These are the Statue of Liberty, which I know about that. Interesting. This is where they keep the heat heat. This is where the oven's located. Look at those phones. I forgot what they're called. Are they Supreme, I think? They got the red ones behind it. They got the Galaxy supposed to come out this year. They got the Dawn Becker phones in the back. The Kobe undefeated joint. The LeBron. You like the LeBron off pearls? Not really. Breast cancer awareness, maybe. Y'all remember those? What about these? Size 13. Those are Yeezy joints. More Yeezy. It's crazy that they got the breads back there. Art Bezel. Tofu Ones. The BR. Shadow Backboards 2.0. The original Shadow Backboards in my size. I like those. Oh, man. They got the cause. Dorn Becker 8. Just on 2. Tofu Room 5. Drake 10. They got a custom bar over here. Similar to the Nike ID we saw in Miami in the Innovation Store in New York where you get some apparel and they'll customize it for you. But look like they're doing shoes as well. And here's a few samples of what they got going on. Damn, it seems like this is a new niche for a lot of people. I remember I did something similar to a pair of Air Jordan 1 high OGs. All right, let's go upstairs. I remember when he did the grand opening, he showed like a tattoo shop, barber shop. I guess that's still popping off because I see people up here. Okay, tattoo artists, barber shop over there in the cut. I don't know what's happening here. Holding is upstairs. And this overlooked the whole entire store. Not bad. I can only imagine what the rent is for a spot like this in a mall like this. Finally, we're about to pull in the cool kick to his pocket. So they got this thing organized by sizes. So 12 is back here. 11 and a half is right here. I'm trying to see what we don't have. We don't have these joints. Those are the Air Jordan 4 SB. I wish I had them. But I got pretty much everything else that I wanted. The Laney's, the Lowe's. Are those the royalties? Playoff? Red Flint, Kobe Grinches, Home Posit, more Kobe's. Oh, these are new joints that came out. Then it's Beaches, right? Yeah. Kobe Ace, they hang you in the head for 450 if you want. You got the bread toe and the bread and the patent bread, pollen, the UNC, and I forgot what these are called, the high lines, I think. They got the trophy rooms, all right. LA, the shot time, I forgot what those are called. So here's the 12s back here. Oh, the dude got the Travis. I remember the Gatorade joint. We have the orange, you have that color. We have the lime, and they also got the Gatorade 6. Oh, wow, these are the 1.2 Air Jordan 1s. I remember finding these in the outlet, like 2015. I even tried them on. I put some images up. I'm so curious to see what they got these hitting for, $500. And you know these are the one point five look at the foul so not the air jordan one box and then do got the dorm becker fives i like these no cap i do like these they're going for 13 oh yeah the fincetta four fly net breath four you remember the fly net jordan one how many of y'all been around for those taxis and 12s i still got my pick what they want for four hundred dollars so that brings us to the end of this video guys this was caesar palace resort is literally a mall inside a hotel how crazy is that? We visit four different sneaker stores, two retail spots and two resale spots, Nike being retail and Culture King. As crazy as it looked, it was a retail shop as well. And the two resale shops was Urban Necessities and Cool Kicks. Anyways, that's it. Thank you for watching. I'm gonna see y'all in the building in the next video. Peace.